patterns are different shapes that we see in the wings of a butterfly, petals of sunflower, plumage of a peacock and on a grill gate. Patterns are arrangement of similar designs in a particular order. Match the group with its kind. Here there are a set of leaves. Find the same kind on the other side. Here is the leaf. A set of dogs, dog. A set of faces, a face. A set of pens, a pen. Set of flowers, flower. Match the animal with its shadow. Here is a frog. Find the shadow of the frog. It is here. Crocodile. Shadow of the crocodile is here. Here is a shark. And this is the shadow of the shark. Here is a starfish. Where is its shadow? It is here. This is a crab. The shadow of the crab is here. Find the odd one and color it. This is not a triangle. It is a hexagon. This is not a circle. It is an oval shape. This is not a square. What is it then? It is a rectangle. This is not a cone. It is a cylinder. Observe the height of the following pictures. Tick the taller object. This tree is taller. This boy is tall. The ladder is taller than the table. The giraffe is taller than the zebra. This rope is long. Observe the length of the following pictures and tick which is longer. This pencil is long. This cue is long. This bus is long. We measure the length or distance in many ways. Hand span, finger span and cubit. Measure the things in the classroom by using your hand span, finger span and cubit. The length of the table is measured by 
hand spends. The length of the pen is measured by finger spans. The length of the blackboard is measured by cubits. The length of the cricket pitch is measured by paces. The size of the hand and foot differs from person to person. So there is a need for the standard unit of measurement. When we use standard units, the measurements would be the same. We measure the length or distance in many ways. Hand span, finger span, cubit, foot and pace. Meter is the standard unit of length. We measure bigger lengths in meters. We measure smaller lengths in centimeters. The scale has centimeters on one side. We buy cloth by measuring its length in meters. A tailor takes measures of length in centimeters to stitch a shirt.